what's going on guys code expert here and in the previous tutorial we created this app of ours with the decentralized functionality and in this tutorial i would like to tell you a little bit more information because this information is really important if you want to become a good developer in tron all right so this is the tron web api we are going to talk so you can go to developers.tron.network and hit api reference and in there you can find that we have all of the apis of tron and there is an api called tron web and you can go there and check out all of the uh, functionalities that it has it is a very powerful api guys you can have all of those um convergence and creating a new account and uh, we have this trx api as well where you can get the accounts get balance you can get contract you can send the transaction you can send the tokens and we have this transaction build as well where you can actually create your own trc 10 tokens and update uh, it's a very powerful thing and I recommend you to go through all of this and in this tutorial we will uh, Tell you a little bit about how to use this API in the future. All right, so if you remember in our Tron um, Index.js in utils we have this Tron web instance which we defined and uh, um, Initialized here in component did mount if you had time you should have have had a look at this and uh, in this tutorial we will use that tron web instance to actually ex uh, extract the data from tron web api all right and uh, the best way uh, the tron web api connects to the tron blockchain is through tron link all right so whatever information that we extract from the tron um, blockchain actually it gets it through the tron link all right so let's uh, um, add another variable here called uh, tron web address and we put it to empty and we will use this get address method if you can or get account yeah this get account method and uh, we will use that method to actually get our um, address and we uh, will once here we define our Tron web instance and once the Tron web instance is defined we type constant uh, TMP underscore Tron web address and is equal to invoke the Tron web um, API dot address and dot from hex so we have this from hex here um, if you look to hex and we have the from hex i don't know you can check it out here it's somewhere but i'm not able to find it anyway but uh, when we actually extract the contra uh, the value we will get the hex and we should convert it into the uh, usual contract so I will show you in a moment uh, what exactly happens so let's have something like this um, await utils dot tronweb dot trx dot get account all right and if we just go here and console here so console dot log and we will log this out so that we can see exactly what's happening go back here in this and cannot read the property trx of undefined Oh, sorry, we should have it capital. Yeah. And now we have all of the account information here, but we want the address of this account. We don't want anything uh, here, balance, current time and everything. We don't want anything of that. So for that, we do uh, like this dot account. All right. 
um, sorry dot address and then we will get the only address of the, our account which is this one but it's a hex key and we will have to convert it into the normal account address so we add another parenthesis to it and we um, add it to string and then another parenthesis to true string and we convert this thing into the hex all right so uh, from hex sorry and everything should now work fine let's see and yeah it's giving an error and that's because we have this strong capital web and we have this address here boom and you can see that this address is actually same as this so you can see that tym5 uh, sorry tym854 and this is tym854 so this is the same address that we wanted so we can delete this thing now and now um, we have this address but we want to use this address so i will just um, create um, another line of code await this dot set state and then um, in that we have tron web address is equal to tmp tron web address all right and we set this to tron web address here which is defined here and we copy this and we have this uh, your address and we paste it this dot state dot tron web address and go back here and you can see that once the address is loaded we will have our address here boom and in in the similar manner manner you can actually use all of this api functionality so in this um, tutorial we use this address uh, we use get account and we used from hex uh, all of these functionalities we used in this tutorial but uh, you can use the remaining functionalities as well as according to your needs and uh, this is very powerful thing and i recommend you to go through once more and uh, get pro in building the decentralized application so in the next tutorial we will understand the vulnerabilities of our smart contracts so that nobody uh, can mess with your smart contract and uh, get the advantage and uh, um, do something illegal with your smart contract all right so let's meet in the next tutorial thanks for watching